How's it going, everyone? And welcome to episode three of Jeffries. Now, the last episode, I finished up the last remaining two hours and encountered that prototype animatronic suit that was in the supply closet parts and service room, whichever room that y'all see it as, and uh, learned what their mechanic was and had a nice, intense final standoff with them at hour five, learned some more background or you know, the truth as to why the whole company shut the whole uh, Jeffrey's location down. And I unlocked the extras, had taken a look at all that cool stuff, and the custom hour. So I will definitely do the custom hour for this episode. So without further ado, let's go ahead and hop right back into Jeffrey's and take on the all max 520 hour boat then, shall we? Oh man. And if that's really cool, that it saves your progress. What? <laughs> hey! Jeffrey didn't even tell me how much of a banger all this soundtrack was. <laughs> Alright, so let's get started with this all max mode here. Okay. So let me just go ahead and go to channel 3 instantly here. And how far... Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, speaking of bangers... Alrighty, Jeffrey. That's really cool. Alright, so... Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Just wait for that to subside there. Oh, boy. Come on. Yeah, get out of here. Oh, God. oh, I got eight lever pulls this time. That is handy. All right, well, I really do like the added... Ooh, security there. Oh gosh. Go on. Get out of here. everyone so i'm back here during the next there's been a couple of things here i just decided to well take like a mental break first off and so uh, qtm had made the prototype slightly slower and had let me know that the same camera stalling trick works on him too so uh just like with jeffrey and well everyone else he also requires my immediate attention so <laughs> I gotta keep my eyes glued on him as much as I possibly can, and hopefully I can ration out the rest of my lever pulls. So yeah, I'm gonna put some more attempts in, uh, you know, this Allmax 520 hour mode. So, yep, here I go. <laughs>
on. I'm gonna stare at you a little bit more. Come on, prototype. Come on, prototype. Don't you dare do it. Don't you dare do it. I'm so close. I'm so close. I don't care about legless. Come on. Come on, dude. I'm so close. Yes! Let's go! I finished off the 520 All Max Hour Mode. Oh, oh man, that was intense. Oh, uh, yeah, giving me that final stare oh, down through the cameras. Eat the All Max. Oh, Didn't think that was yeah, possible. Oh, well, uh, congrats, I guess. Um, yeah, appreciate it. Yeah, I didn't. I, I didn't think it was gonna be possible. I know everybody says that about their fan games. If if I beat any of those, but you know, Second. the game. Well, I mean, I, I haven't. I'm recording this before the game was actually properly playtested, so I don't know if it's actually going to be possible. I haven't beat it yet personally, so if you've taken a peek at the extras, you would know that I already did a dev message on there, but that was pretty vague. Like, there, there wasn't really much to it, so I thought, I mean, th this has been done before, like, uh, I, I thought I'd el elaborate a bit more, I mean, yeah, yeah, I know this kind of, like, speech thing, it's been in some of the fan games, Catastrophe, 1, 2, I think, in, you know, it's a, a, I don't know any others, but, you know, I know it's in those two. Uh, just a quick note, if you don't want to listen to my ramblings, you can, uh, press circle. Uh, any at any time, you know. Uh, so you know, you, you can just you can leave, and then I think well, it's gonna pop up in the extras now. Well, after you listen, so then you'd be able to, you know, re replay. Or you're allowed to replay this speech rather than the text one. Of my evolution in the past two years. I mean, it it the two. The second anniversary of the character Jeffrey, the concept that started the game's development, was on the 9th of December, so it was 2021. So, he's already, the character's already around two years old, and the game is well by the time of recording still not out. So, I didn't think I was able to balance the game that well that the all max ends up actually being possible. So, good on you. Um, yeah. Yeah, appreciate the it. Game, <laughs> yeah, so the past, I've already said this, the past two years, if you looked at the game, start of the game's development, you could tell that I was not that good at making just generally things. The game originated under the name of A Week at Jeffrey's, or well, it actually, the character actually started as Jeffy, so not Jeffrey's, Je it was Jeffy, uh, about the E, R, and the E. So, his character was pretty underdeveloped, it was still just, I, I didn't even, I don't think I even knew what his, like, animal was, his species that he was representing was at that time. I mean, we all know now that he's a rabbit, unless you don't know that. Um, the game was originally going to come out at some point in 2022, but it, you know, it didn't, because I want, well, there's a point where I realised just how underdeveloped the game is, not only a concept, but an, like, an actual functioning game was so that's why i held it back for the past well, well pro probably all, all two years now uh, just to be able to make this game the best it could be i mean i sure do hope you'll like it but yeah so the character's been through multiple iterations you can view those in the extras menu um well, and, and all of the characters, originally there was going to be a third character called Dylan, which was like a bat, and then I went through multiple iterations of other characters, none I actually settled on, because they kind of just felt like they were filler characters. Criticisms really drove the game, in my opinion, to where it is now, because it, it's taken, yeah, it's taken it a long way, considering where it started, you know, constantly getting feedback from people like Autumn Satire, uh, the other people, it really drove the game to be just as good as I hoped it would be. I mean, I, again, I do hope that you'll like it, but you know, I'm kind of, I think, I think I'm really happy with the product I've actually made. The third version of Jeffrey's model, um, the fourth, well, no, not the, the well, the four V4 goes for the second map, well, up to V6, I think it is, and then. With V7, which is an improved head model, um, the one that you see uh, is the third. 
third one, which is in nuclear. The game was really inspired off seeing all these other fan games and thinking, you know, I wanted I wanted to have, make my own characters and make my own thing rather than the dream glitch which I had at the time. Um, the, the release of the dream glitch was actually is actually quite well like a couple months older than Jeffrey's conception. Um, yeah, so I wanted to make my own fan game and. You know, it's inspired by a couple others, but you know, that's what drove me to create Jeffries as it started and what it's like now. You know, as a well, currently it's basically done. Uh, you know, as a complete game. You know, I really do appreciate everyone who's been here with me on this journey from when I started the game to when I finished it, and just by playing the game, uh, you're. You know, I, I really appreciate everything everyone has done for me during the development of this game, and you know, as it continues up up to for the game's release. So, uh, yeah, I really appreciate every single person who supports the game, even in the slightest. Like, even if even if you like the game and find me annoying or something, like you know, it's still still I appreciate you supporting the game. Uh, if you get my reference, you get my reference. Um, but you know. I just, I just appreciate all of it, and I think that concludes everything I really want to say um, oh, about okay. the development of the game. I mean, there, there's a lot more I could talk about, but that'll pro I'll probably save that for some sort of Q and A at some point in the future, probably. All right, see you on the flip side. All right, see you on the flip side as well, QTM. Oh man, that was a lot of wholesome stuff right there packed into that little. Uh, segment right there and what do you look at that right up there i got the second star right on the menu and i really do like that shade of green and purple there too oh man that was really fun <laughs> one tiny thing before i end off this episode so if we go back to the extras and go all the way down we can see that there's a new button to replay that whole speech that we heard a few seconds ago So that pretty much wraps it up here for episode three of Jeffries. Yet another really sick all max mode using all of the camera system there to look at everyone, including the prototype and Jeffrey at the same time, just to keep them calm and not use up all of my lever pulls. And oh man, at the very end there too. <laughs> That was insane. I did not have any more lever pulls whatsoever, and the prototype was about to attack me. And so I was trying to watch out for Connor just to make sure that he didn't uh, pull up right through the cameras and then yank me on through. Um, hey, I was keeping my eyes on the prototype, and uh, that was kind of intense in a way, just locking with each other's eyes right as the hour turned over another hour there. <laughs> So in the next episode, I will take on the new game plus mode and uh, see how intense all of that is going to be. So stay tuned for that in the finale of Jeffries. So if anyone has enjoyed this entire episode here as I took on the All Max 520 hour mode, then y'all know what to do down there since all of you are amazing. Like, comment, and definitely subscribe if you haven't already, or else you'll go through an entire hour with a handful of animatronics all set to 20 mode, and good luck to you if you uh, make it over another hour. And hit that bell to be notified of all my future content and streams, because I do sometimes stream my channel and another episode which will be ultimately the finale of the Jeffries series. So I'll see you all in the next video or stream. Thank you guys so much for watching this, and yeah, see y'all.